Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto and welcome to this new video on Mask and the Mask Network. Wanted to do a quick video on that because, uh, well, first of all, take a look at the chart. We've been very bullish. We had some major bullish breakouts uh, and I wanted to talk about whether we can actually continue this rally up to our next price target around 7.25. Uh, to keep it simple, but more about that later. Um, so that's why I wanted to talk about that. I also know that a lot of you uh, from the Selenix crypto community are, have traded and are trading uh, mask right now. So also wanted to do it for you. Wanted to give you my thoughts on what's most likely to happen. Uh, now mask, to be honest, it looks a bit manipulated, um, but it's um, yeah, that's that's just how mask has always been. If you take a look at the volume. There's, um, it, it almost looks like there's uh, some sort of uh, Chinese volume coming into the coming into the markets at Musk. Um, usually, with cryptos where that's the case, or where we have a high probability that that's the case, you see volume distribution like this: a lot from BitUbu, a lot from OKX, a lot from XT. Um, so that uh, that could be very powerful, but it does need to be confirmed first by the technicals. So we'll focus on that. Um, and before we do that, I do want to say that if you want to receive daily trading signals, check out the links in either the description or the pinned comment, and there you'll find instructions on how to join that. We've been very profitable so far, so check that out. All right, so right now with Mask, as I said, a lot of bullish momentum. The reason why we were bullish doesn't matter that much, but we were very bullish. Uh, found support at around this level, around $5. Strong support level, strong psychological support level, had that 50 EMA, so... Uh, altogether, <clears throat> you could have expected that we would get some bullish momentum from that level, and I think some of you also did. Then from there, we reached our major resistance level, which is this level around 5.5. 5.5, 5 5.6, that area. Uh, and there we got a massive bullish breakout. So I think that was the main technical cataclyst that, that pushed us all the way up to our previous tops, around uh, 6.5. And that's where we are uh, right now. We have hit 6.5. And now we're trying to hold our last bullish breakout, which is this level right here. Um, and I'm not too sure if I should uh, if I should drag it go drag it all the way down to six dollars. I don't think so. We're not reacting to six dollars that much to, uh, with Musk. Uh, so I'm going to keep it at that we have. Excuse me. I'm just going to clear this up a bit. That looks better. So our main support level right now is this level around six point oh five and six point fifty. That's our support level. And that's also the key level right now, in my opinion, if we really want to get higher than where we went. We went to 6.5. Next resistance level is around 6.1, 6.5. So kind of in the middle, 7.3. Excuse me, I said 6. I meant 7. Uh, the only way in which we could get there is if we are able to hold this level for the next 24 hours. If for the next 24 hours we can stay on top of 6.05, I think that's an indication that there's enough bullish momentum to also break above 6.4, 6.5 and rally up to, uh, up to that level. Now, I have to be honest though, it's way easier said than done to do that. Uh, you can already see that right after hitting 6.5, we drop down to that level and we're struggling to hold it. Um, so I actually think it's more likely. Uh, it's, it's, I mean, this is very realistic. It's, it's very close. It's like this has a 40% chance. Uh, of happening and I think there's a 60% chance so a little bit more likely that we'll drop down below 6.05 find support at 5.9 take a break retest and drop down to 5.6 5.5 I think that's a bit more likely uh, given the given the circumstances with the volume but also just historically what usually happens after you get a second rally like this but I guess we'll see I'll keep you updated on that uh, but for now take care thanks for watching and bye